Hello guys, welcome to part 33 of Let's Play Final Fantasy, brought to you by GameAnyone.com and I'm still lost right now, have a shit. I think this is going to get a hell of a lot easier now, now that I can actually go anywhere on the boat. I'm finally on the boat for the first time in a long while. I got nothing better to sing about, so I'm just going to keep going. I think I gotta go somewhere. Hey, who the hell are you? Not all the places can be reached by boat, and it's the treasures in those places that I just can't get to. You can supposedly reach them with a canoe or an airship. I've also heard that using a levestone at the oasis of the desert can raise an airship from the sands. That doesn't do me so much good since I can't find a bloody levestone. Yeah, you're shit out of luck and jolly well fucked. Anyway, I think there's a little area that I can't get to before. Alright, everyone's getting a level. That's always good. Random enemy encounters. That's sometimes good. But when you got something to do, it's always bad. It's so bad. It's so nasty. Where am I supposed to go? Like, it doesn't give you much instruction. Like, there's a new enemy, the Elm Gygus. Gygus of Elm Trees, even though I am blue. Like, are you the Gygus of Elm Street? What the fuck are you? I haven't seen this before. Yeah, that palm tree was a little suspicious. Hey, did I just take the Levestone out of my own airship and just bring it with me? But how do you store that? Well, if you sit down and the Levestone's in your back pocket, you've got your anus perforated. Well, that's just a bad place to store it. Like, if you store it in your front pocket, like in your, around your pelvic area, what are you going to do when you're fucking your, fucking your hoe? You're going to penetrate both of you. Anyways, and you... Okay, what just happened? Oh, okay, I got it, I got it. Oh, for a moment there, I thought the game froze. I accidentally clicked outside the bra outside the window. And I obtained an airship again. So technically, I have two airships, but I can't take this one with me. And all I can do is just go straight on. I believe I can go to this hole, that's the exit. Okay, what's this place? What's this place's gimmick? I don't think it's the people again. 250 bucks, that's bullshit. I can buy five minutes to Tiger Woods' wife, who's probably available now. <laughs> Just gonna cheat on her. And if you are gonna cheat on her, make sure your sport is not dangerous. If you're a fencer, run. You don't want her chasing you with a foil, I can tell you that. Okay, I think those jokes are just old now. I don't think anyone cares about them. Like, I think he's been in the butt end of jokes for far too long. And that's just gotta go. Oh, found the exit already! What am I doing? Let's just go to Lady. Okay, since this is B10, that means I got a choice of two more bosses. What one do I want? I'm gonna do an in-game save since I haven't done that in a while. I've done since B5. Right. Oh wait, I forgot ethers. I wanna make sure everyone got plenty of magic at least. Okay, we're good to go. I suppose I underestimated you. I didn't think you would make it this far. 
No matter, Barbarishia's winds shall cut you down. Oh, another Archfiend. And she doesn't hide her hair on like Final Fantasy IV, so you're good to go walking around anytime you want. Okay, what kind of magic should I use? Uh, maybe a Proterra in case she hits ya. She could be a fiery bitch. Despite the fact she's the Archfiend of Wind, she can still be pretty fiery. You got some long ass hair, too. Yeah, I think this would be a good time to be using, like, a Kialaga or something. Because damn, Barbarisha can hit you pretty hard. I think she's more of a physical enemy. Don't want to prolong this battle too much. So I'll end up regretting it. Yeah, he's not a heal Aga, why not? She's fast too, she hit you four times. I think I'm about to use Invisera next. Once everyone's in pretty good health. Oh, where is it? Oh, there it is. Ray! What's that? Oh, I think I'm gonna cast Stone. Doesn't matter. It didn't work! Buff Retro right up. I think I'm going to use him to attack only. I don't care about getting myself a kill against these bosses. I just want to win. Damn, she's still not dead. I mean, she is eye candy, I can tell you that. But you don't want to leave her around. That's just a dangerous thing to do. Uh oh! Cyclone! I don't know how much damage is that gonna do? Ooh! That hit pretty hard! Got her! Ha <laughs> ha! Two more to go! Then I'm done with this place too. Ooh, I got a new weapon! The Braveheart! Okay, I cannot use it. And yeah, I can, but it's not as good as Sasuke's Blade. Well, I got no choice, I have to leave now. Okay, now I gotta attempt this place one more time, and then that's it. Then it's on the Life Spring Grotto. Oh, it's the people again. I hate people! Especially old men. If I remember correctly, I think the exit was somewhere around here. Oh wait, no it wasn't. Come on, move your ass. Come on, come on. I think the exit was right here, past this guy. Oh, no, no, never mind. It's here for treasure. Fermi shoes. I can cast haste as an item now. So it's only for one use, sadly. I don't care if there's an enemy encounter, I think I just gotta go straight out in the corner. That's too bad the Braveheart weapon I got is not useful. I mean, yeah, it casts Confuse as an item, which is pretty neat. 
even though I don't even use Confuse at all. But still, I mean... Hey, that's pretty cool that you can get a sword here. It's not the best one you can get. I believe the best one is Ultima Weapon. Oh, one more random encounter that I can go to out here. Okay, I think I'm gonna stop here. Stay tuned for the next part. See ya, everyone.